Hello, how are you doing? Okay, in this video, we are going to see browser stack integration with Catalan Studio. Mainly, I'm going to show execution of Catalan automated scripts on browser stack. It is super easy, very simple, and very, very useful for real time crowd browser testing. Okay, so let's get into details. Okay, firstly, I will give a brief introduction about what is Catalan Studio and browser stack. Okay, so Catalan Studio is a free automation testing solution developed by Catalan company. The software is built on top of open source automation frameworks, Selenium APM with a specified IDE interface, which is very useful to use uh, for API, web and mobile testing. Brother Stack is a cloud based web and mobile testing platform that enables developers to test their websites and mobile applications across on-demand browsers, operating systems, and real-time mobile devices without requiring users to install or maintain an internal lab for virtual machines, right? Okay, to make my demonstration super easy, I have listed the flow as steps. So the steps looks like this. Step one, we are going to see create test scripts in Catalan Studio. Step two, create a browser stack account. Step three, running test in browser stack from Catalan script development mode. And step four, uh, running test in browser stack from Catalan test suite. And again, test collection. Okay, let's see these steps. Okay, so step one, create test scripts in Catalan Studio. Okay, so in my video, so uh, I have already created um, two scripts in Catalan Studio, find your flight and launch application for demonstration. Uh, if you don't know how to create, you can go to my YouTube channel and find out Catalan Studio create an automated test in manual mode. So that will explain you how to create test in Catalan Studio. Okay, so assuming that so you already know how to create scripts in Catalan. So um, we can move on to step two. Okay, step two, create a browser stack account. Okay, so in my video, so since I already have got a browser stack account, I'm using that. So um, if you don't have an account, so you can sign up new account and it, it can create your own account. It gives you a free hours of testing. So you can try, you can practice with that. Um, yeah, so enter username and password. So when you log into browser stack, so it takes you to uh, browser stack dashboard. Okay, so when you log in, it looks something like this. So um, now we get to product. You can see all all the services uh, which can be used for testing live, automated app live app automation. So currently now I'm going to show automated platform. That is what we're going to use to integrate with Catalan Studio. Okay, so mainly what we need um, once you logged into browser stack account, it should navigate to account and settings. So this is where you can see um, your account details. Okay. So go to settings and we we need access key and um, your URL, browser stack URL, which is required to construct um, the grid URL. Okay, that is where that, that is what we're gonna use to execute Catalan script. Fine. Okay, step three, run test in browser stack from Catalan script development mode. Um, when you go to Catalan, there are two different modes. One is uh, development mode where you develop scripts okay so while developing scripts you execute okay that's we call as development uh, mode to execute the test so next the mode two is um, test suite and collection mode so the the test suite is something like um, combination of more than one test scripts we clubbing all of them and running together okay so again collection is something new to um, text execution uh, that is where Catalan is introduced at so we can combine multiple test suite and execute okay so let's see how to execute script on browser stack from development mode assume so you're developing a script so find a flight now if I want to execute this it's very very simple so what you have to do it um, code execution and select remote okay so basically here you have to provide brother stack the grid detail so where you're going to execute that okay it's very simple to get that so what you have to do go to brother stack um, under product click on automate uh, if your account is new you, you don't have any test has been executed then you see this dashboard so go to run sample test 
yeah so under java or any programming um, concept so you can go and see that so your username automation key and your url pattern this is the url pattern we require to um, provide in catalon to execute this particular test okay so take this copy entire script without inverted comma and go back to catalan and paste it here okay so again go back and take username and come back and remove that particular string and paste it here okay so again you go back to browser stack and select your key and come here and remove that string and paste it yes okay it looks something like this now okay this is the url when the when i execute click on okay now my expectation is that particular test should be executing on brother stack okay so execution started and you can see that it's already stating writing the steps and go to brother stack and uh, refresh your page under automate option you can see a uh, test execution is happening on a particular browser uh, chrome in in my case and uh, operating system windows 10 so you can see that um, each step has been captured here you know since i have given a screenshot so screenshot has been captured and even all steps has been written here okay so it's captured here still it's execution is happening so go back to catalan studio and see uh, what's happening okay that it looks like execution has been done um yeah it says execution has been done go back to brother stack and see how okay it says now the one minute ago execution has been completed so okay refresh it so in brother stack good thing is it captures the text log which is eventually steps all the information of the steps has been captured with screenshot on steps any failure details or past details everything yeah and also it captures some more information visual logs console, lo console logs network logs anyway um, I haven't given this option so we can see that now when I prepare um, new video about brother stack all this in detail and also it captures video which is very very important okay the whole execution video has been captured here you can play that here and see um, how your execution went on during test execution okay so this is about running test in brother stack from catalan development mode okay so next we'll see next time okay step four is running test in brother stack from catalan test suite mode okay as i have already explained uh, test suite is collection of test cases which has been written here so you can create in uh, test suites a number of test suites in catalan studio and you can add all those tests so i have added here these two tests into test suites so i can execute this to execute this there's a, a small configuration test execution configuration you have to do um, to do that go to project and settings and under test execution go to custom so this is where you can uh, define your custom execution requirements okay so you can give name and um, click on the slit icon here it, it opens custom execution configuration builder again and give which type of driver you're going to execute as a remote driver on brother stack or anything it could be source lab or any uh, third party platform so it's eventually it's a remote driver if something else you can select options okay so now currently we see only remote and again uh, click on little icon here it opens driver builder that is where you should provide the the grid detail of brother stack which have which we have seen in our uh, previous steps okay so remote web server type is selenium and also we have apm which which we can talk about while executing uh, mobile apps uh, execution so that we can see that later um, and also we can provide some more capabilities okay the capabilities which we provide in selenium um, while writing java c sharp code same capability information you can give in a very simple manner here okay once these digital has been given and click ok it's been saved then you can see under execution under custom capability you can see the custom execution name which you have provided there so you can like this you can create number of uh, configurations based on your requirement if you want to execute a same test on multiple different combinations of brothers and uh, um, and operating system then you can configure and execute it okay so select this and see how execution happens 
So in this case, now since I have selected two test scripts in test suite, so there should be two executions should be happening under the stack. Okay, so you can see that here, uh, refresh the page. Um, I can see the Catalan, um, the same test Catalan test suites run under the stack. You can see that. Okay, so it's capturing during execution, it's capturing video and steps um, have been captured. And also, um, if you refresh this page, you can see the second test is being started executing. The first test is very simple steps. Um, and just uh, launching the application. And the second step, second one is, which eventually is launching application and creating um, some more steps. Okay, you can see the time difference. So the, the first, the step three, the test which has been executed, step four, which has been executed, year two test. Okay, so similarly, um, go back to Catalan Studio. So you can execute combining multiple test suites from test collection. Okay, so eventually it is something like you can combine multiple test suites and execute that. So while executing, we have a little configuration settings here where you can select um, uh, some of the custom combinations, some of the local combinations. You can select all these permutation and combination based on requirement and you can execute that. This is very, very useful, friends. Okay. I hope uh, this video is going to be more useful for a uh, Selenium and Catalan automation tester. Uh, please share this video and like uh, my uh, YouTube channel and watch all my YouTube videos. Thank you.